Freddie loves a nice camera moment. Oh my god, she's getting the camera dirty. <laughs> Freddie! It's raining so much. So exciting. I love rain. This might be an unpopular opinion, but I love rain. So the first thing I did this morning, very exciting. I got stickers from All Things Lily and this is my first time getting something from her. I've always wanted to, my cat, but she just released like a ton of new stickers. So I got like a ton of those. So that was really exciting, but now I'm really hungry. So I don't know what we're gonna do about that because it's kind of an awkward time. It's almost 11. I woke up at 10.30 today because it's a Saturday and for some reason this whole week I've been super tired. Like it's very unlike me to wake up at 10.30. I'm a little more of an early bird, but I do think I really needed the sleep. I don't know why I was so tired this week. Um, so yeah, we need food. Do I just go to lunch or do I still try to eat breakfast? That's the real question. I think I might eat my lunch because I know what I'm having for lunch. My mom got me sushi when she went to the grocery store. So that is what I'm having for lunch. Um, I might just eat it now. Also, I can hear the rain and it's beautiful. I love rain so much. I could just look at it all day. That was honestly kind of unpleasant. I switched over to a podcast pretty quickly and I kind of just watched the rain as I ate. But I think I'm gonna make some coffee. I know it's weird. I ate lunch and then I don't, it's, it's weird. Let me show you how I make my coffee. Take a mug, take some coffee. Which I need to warm that. It's a little warm right now. I'm gonna put it in the microwave. So then I take the best thing in the world, which is the Chobani Plain Extra Creamy Oat Milk. This is the best oat milk I've ever had. I didn't really see that much of a difference, but this one, you see a difference? Oh my god. Get the coffee. Now my coffee is hot. So first I put a little of the oat milk in it. And then I take a separate cup, a small one, and I put some oat milk in. And this is the fun part. I get my candy dandy milk frother and I stir my main cup of coffee with this, with a little bit of oat milk, just so it's all mixed together. And then I froth, then I froth the extra oat milk, and this is to put on top. I put in some oat milk in the main, in the coffee, so it's not super bitter when I drink, and then this is to top it and make it all foamy and fun. And then just like look and see if it's looking foamy. That's good. And then here's the fun part. Honestly, if you don't have a milk frother, go get one. Like almond milk, a lot of like thinner nut milks don't froth well. So I found that this oat milk froths well. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys. Oh, it doesn't look super fancy today. I think that I need to change the batteries of my milk frother because it has not been performing its best. But then sometimes I'll like sprinkle some cinnamon or like some pumpkin spice over it to make it all fancy. But it didn't froth really well today, so I'm not gonna do that. But I mean, it's pretty just basic coffee. It's a nice oat milk latte. I'm not good with locks. Good job, Franny! Bird? Come on, Birdie! They don't like the rain. Good job, Franny! She especially doesn't, but she's going. And then we have Harry. Mm. Yay, good job! Good job, Franny! They're disgusting! Yes, she went back to bed! Soaking wet! Hi, Franny! You're so wet! <laughs> I literally just played Animal Crossing for so long. I started at like 11.30 and now it's 2, well it's 2.22, but it's almost 2.30. I just had a lot to do. I had to set up and get materials for three houses for three new residents, so. Today, something exciting came in the mail. I got my new journal, so 
this is what I will be using next when I finish my current journal. I decided to go with this color. I don't know why. I was just really feeling it when I was looking at journals. So I can't wait to decorate this because it's super plain on the outside. And I ordered my new stickers from All Things Lily and today I love her shop. So yeah, I'll do a whole video where I like decorate it and stuff. But I still have a little ways to go here. As you can see, this new one is a little bigger. So we'll see how that goes. But what I'm most excited about is that it's grid paper this time. It's what I thought I was getting with this one, but it's blank, which blank is the worst it could be, but it's fine. I have this little sliver to go. It's like mostly filled out. So I'm really excited to finish this. Let's see how many pages. I have 21 pages left. I mean, it could take me any amount of time to fill 21 pages. It could be another month. It could be way less than that. Who knows? I just I want to fill this one up already. I start to get real impatient when I'm getting towards the end of my journals because I just want to move on to the next one. But it's fine because the stickers I want to put on this one haven't even come in yet. So I can't even get that one set up yet. I printed these off from Rainbowholic. She had some free printables. And this one was Animal Crossing ones. So I want to do an Animal Crossing spread. I don't know if I'll do it today. Also, I need to walk my dogs. But it's really rainy out. I don't know where today is going. But I'm getting kind of hungry. So I might go downstairs and like find a snack or eat a real lunch because that was kind of breakfast and it was kind of repulsive. So I go, might go look at food. Oh my God, some ramen might be good. I'm gonna go make ramen. It is 3.18 and I've just been listening to podcasts so far and I think it's time for my afternoon coffee. So what I do on school days and kind of just every day is I have my morning coffee, which is a hot coffee, and then I have my afternoon coffee, which is whipped coffee. Dalgona coffee is best with chocolate milk. Normally I use the Chobani chocolate oat milk, but we're running low, so I decided to make my own chocolate milk in it. I've never made it with Hershey chocolate syrup, so... Okay. I'm going to do some editing because I love editing and working on YouTube stuff, so that's why I made this little treat to go along. This, like, makes, makes me be more productive because I'm like, oh... I gotta have a reason to drink this, you know? I sit down, be one of those people with my coffee. This is my first Netflix watch party and I'm doing it with my friends. This is my first real event of the day. My first social activity in a while. So I wrapped up watching the show with my friends. We watched Pose on Netflix and it is so good. The episodes are kind of long. They're like an hour and 10 or an hour and 20 minutes, but A plus show. It's so good. I highly recommend. Today has been a pretty lazy day. Pretty simple, pretty boring. I feel like I need to do a little workout or something because I haven't even stepped outside today because it is rainy. Normally not like this, but I don't know. Something simple. 
Um, I think it's time for me to do some journaling, and then after that, my sister and I might watch some of our new Asian drama, Accidentally in Love. So far, it's not quite as good as the other ones we've seen. My first first love was really good, which was a Korean drama, Meteor Garden. Our first, a classic Chinese drama, Good Morning Call, love, Japanese drama. Um, also, we watched one, Put Your Head on My Shoulder. Um, I love that one. <laughs> and we just watched The Love Alarm before this, so. We'll see, it might get better. But yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do after I journal and stuff. It's already like eight, but we'll probably make mug cakes when we do that because that's what we do. We have mug cake nights. So before I start officially journaling and stuff, I'm going to make a to-do list for tomorrow. And these are super helpful. Just writing out what I'm going to do the next day in the right order. Not assigning any specific times because I normally find that unattainable. So I just write down things to do and like kind of in the order to do it. And this has really helped me. I've done it one day where it was literally just magical. I did exactly what it said. don't know if every day is going to be like that, but I'm going to write out for tomorrow. So today I kind of let myself have just a lazy day and tomorrow for Sunday I'm going to try to be a little more productive and take advantage of the time I have. I think I'm going to let myself wake up a little later because it is a Sunday and I should let myself have the rest that I don't always get. I mean I always get enough sleep but I have been so tired in the weekdays lately. When I say wake up by nine it gives me some leeway so that I don't have a specific time to reach because I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> I just know my Myself. I can wake up a little before then or something. I just have to be up by nine. And then I just say, and eat breakfast. Might not jump into Animal Crossing quite yet. Maybe I'll get something done for school because I do have quite a bit of homework. When I did this before, I scheduled like, I scheduled the specific tasks, which I think was helpful, but I don't really know which homework I'm to be doing. So I've done this before where it's, I just have to complete one item for homework. After I complete just one item of homework, I get an Animal Crossing break because it is Sunday. After that, I'm going to do some YouTube editing. Next is YouTube editing because I don't always get to do that during the week because of school. So, so I could see myself editing until lunch, eat lunch, then maybe I'll do another one thing for school and then Animal Crossing break. Yay, another Animal Crossing break. I would say a walk. After I walk my animals, I'm probably gonna have to go back to homework because, like I said, I do kind of have a lot of homework. So I think I'm just gonna say work on homework rather than get one item done because I might just need to be working at this point. Probably dinner, but then I'll probably have to go back to working on homework. So I'm just gonna say dinner slash more homework. I only have one more space on this list, so I'm just gonna say YouTube. And that just means I get to watch YouTube and stuff. I left one blank so that I could put the date for the day. So this is my list for Sunday and hopefully I'll just follow along. Now that I think about it, I'm starting to get stressed about the amount of homework I have, which I just think is ridiculous. Now is not the time for me to be stressing out over homework. We're not going to talk about it. Now I'm going to go to regular journaling. One item that I collected for my day was my bubble wrapper and I'll just cut this up and put it on my page. I just went through my book cart and picked out a book for my sister to read and it's kind of inspired me to read. So I'm actually in the middle of a book right now. I don't know, I was looking through and I was like, wait, did I finish that book? Like, I remember this book. I just thought I had finished it. I think I'm gonna check this book out. See if I still have ways to go or not. But yeah, this is the end of the night. I'm going to bed after this. So thank you for watching this video and I will see you in my next one. Thank you.